Hi and welcome to another one of our videos where today I'm going to be showing you a single leg, uh, well, sometimes called a single leg uh, Bulgarian squat or split squat, whatever you want to call it. It's, it, it is a very tough exercise for your glutes um, and your core and everything, but you're really going to be pounding your glutes big time in this and the hamstrings as well. So let's have a look at how it works. So Basically, you're like you're loading up with a foot on the, on a box or a step or a bench or something behind you, and you're not trying to lunge on it. So, make this is a difference between a lunge and this one. This, you basically you you the difference is that you're not trying to stay vertical. You can sort of see I'm I'm really sliding back and getting into this. So, where, where a lunge stance would pretty much have a little bit more of a vertical knee, and I wouldn't have this bent over action. I'm, I'm usually a lot straighter on that. Um, and obviously the back foot helps me a lot more on a lunge than it does in this one. Um, so the, the real, this is very much a, like a hip dominant exercise. So that's why it really pounds your glutes in a big way. Now we, we often, usually we would start with um, dumbbells um, with people on this and once they progress to a point where the dumbbells get too heavy to hang on to because it becomes like a bit of a farmer's walk in a way, um, that's when we want to progress to a barbell. But I'd even even if they're not strong enough, sometimes I'll progress to the barbell just because it gives me a different dimension in terms of how they stabilise, which I'm going to show you in a second. All right, so the difference of the barbell um, versus a dumbbell is, and you'll see here is when when I come from behind and have a look at what I'm doing, you'll see that uh, that the barbell can move around a little bit, a lot more than what it would with a with a dumbbell. Dumbbells, can, you can sort of manoeuvre them a little bit. If I just go back, and you'll see here, and, and I'm a little bit off centre there. See how I've sort of shifted? You couldn't quite see that on the other angle, but as you can see from the... And at, at the time, I didn't really sense it. I, um, where I should have been a little bit more here. That, that would, obviously, you can see that yourself, but um, that's where I've sort of favoured something on this side, and I've really shifted out, and I had to... As I kept going, I sort of felt, oh, okay, that's, I'm sort of losing it a bit here. And the barbell forced me to change what I was doing to straighten up. And so then I started to get a little bit more straight at that time. And that's where your coach might give you some cues where you don't notice that with dumbbells because it's not like that sort of seesaw resting on your, on your shoulders there. This is where this is a good, good change up to add the, the barbell to someone um, to really force them to work harder. Um, and get it right every time. All right, so that's why we use the barbell instead of dumbbells.